mockery of justice is what it is. Lord Elwyn would never have stood for this. Quiet, you! I think we're loyalists. Jill, look. Rosaria must be cleansed of the stain which befouls her, that she might rise once again from the ashes to welcome a new dawn. <laughs> Twould be a pity to make examples of you all for the transgressions of but a handful. Of course, your lordship. You shall have our full cooperation. What business could the Black Shields have in a village this small? There's barely room to hide a bearer. Then they must be here for something else. You fancy dancing a gallows jig like the Miller's son? All right. I heard you. No, I ain't got much, but what's mine is yours. For a price. There you are. Much obliged. There you are. I reckon that's fair. I'd pay more if I could. I'll find it a good home. I'd pay more if I could. Fare you well. Excuse me, but what was all that about earlier? You haven't heard? Someone's been stirring up trouble. There have been attacks on the garrison, supplies stolen. They even say a black shield was murdered. The Empire wants answers, and what the Empire wants, Empire gets. Don't they just? Keep your ears open, eh? The black shields will pay good coin for information on the culprits. You'd have to be dull as a sack of stones to think you could take on the. We're going hunting for outlaws. seen him, didn't you? I'm sorry. The Black Shields. Just now. You seen him, didn't you? At least I think they was the Black Shields. Can't say I ever saw one before. Was this the first time they visited the village? Well, what do you think? Amber's the arse end of nowhere. And they thought we might be harboring firebrands. Huh. If only we were. I might have turned him in and become a Black Shield myself. You don't think these firebrands the Empire is looking for could be us, do you? I don't know. But we need to find out. Greetings, friend. We are travelers. I know that. What do you want? We couldn't help noticing those Imperial soldiers who were here earlier. Don't you go telling these strangers a thing. I speak for the people of this village, and we have nothing more to say to you. You are to leave Amber and never come back. May I at least ask why? I don't know who you are or what brings you here, but your presence puts us all in grave danger. The Empire is a harsh master. Its demands are great, and it's just as swift. But as long as we keep our heads down and pay our tributes, we are left alone. Some might call it submission. 
But if it will spare my people the Vicerine's wrath, then I will gladly submit. This village will not become another East Pool. Then we shall be on our way. These people live with a knife to their throat. In the mistaken belief that if they cooperate, my mother will show them mercy. Obedience bought with fear. Are you all right? Sorry, I... It's nothing. We still don't know who the Black Shields are looking for. Well, whoever they are, the Imperials deem them worth pursuing to the back of beyond. But other than Martha, who else in Rosari would have the courage to stand against the Empire? A new ally would certainly be welcome. Can we find them before the Imperials do? Perhaps the next village will yield more answers. Perhaps. This pass will take us through the mountains. And directly into the path of whoever or whatever lurks here. Ever since the Apollo tree, we've seen more and more of these echoes. What do you think is waiting in The Mother Crystal's collapse? I have an idea. You're not going to like it.
Blood, Clive. And still wet. You were told to stay in your homes. The Black Shields. You know who we are. And still, you would bear your steel. Why then? We owe you our thanks. You have saved us the trouble of an interrogation. To dwell in darkness, that we may purge the night and welcome lasting doors. On these, our swords we swear. Say that again. I'll show you a true shield, Rosaria. Stay down! Tell me what I want, and the end will be swift. Who are you looking for? <sighs> Why, you. We come bearing a message. Your friends have been found. The branded you freed from our camps. <sighs> they await you in Ordeal. Guardians of the Flame. Those are Old Hill's gates. Then we hurry. something, boy. Death. This was my mother's doing. But why? Why would anyone... I don't know. I never truly understood her. But this... Oh, Clive. And I will end it. We should go. Yes.
We can't leave them here like this. We won't. But if the Black Shields have made it this far south, they may already be in Port Isolde. We're approaching Buick Bridge. Though I doubt the Empire would let us cross over to Rosalith. There's a curfew, but there are few just passage. I'd like to sell my bears. They're all Rosarian. But this is their home. Ah, uh, I'm hungry. The Empire would have us live in the Deadlands. Ugh! <laughs> 
Lazarus. What happened to this place? My mother happened. The nobles who lived here didn't stand a chance. Let's hope my uncle fared better. That's the main gate. And it looks like we're not the only ones hoping to get in. Let us pass! My children are starving! Have mercy! chance of slipping through unnoticed. We'll need to find another way in. I thought we might be able to reason with the guards. Or at least bribe them. I suspect everyone in that crowd thought the same. Was that the only way in? Officially, yes. Strictly speaking, no. My uncle once told me that the nobles had tunnels built, so that they could visit town without having to walk amongst the rabble. The Lazarus. We'll find our way into the city there. If you're sure. And the entire place looked abandoned. Do you think it's safe? As long as it is abandoned. The good news is we haven't seen a single black shield since Old Hill. Maybe they found who they were looking for. Oh, 
open the damn gate! Why won't they let us get sleep? closer? This is nothing like I remember it. How quickly a crown can lose its luster. Not abandoned then. Oi! Visitors! Apologies. We'll show ourselves out. I've only ever seen one man fight like that. And he's long dead. Then perhaps it's time you joined him. The blessing of the Phoenix. It can't be. I was there when you died. I knew not whom I addressed. You have naught to fear from us. Founder, it really is you. It is. So wait. We can speak inside. And those who wouldn't bend the knee? We left before the Empire could make examples of us, though we didn't go far and we banded together to form the Guardians of the Flame soon after. Alas, there is only so much a handful of aging shields can do against the might of an empire. But we've seen to it that their stay has been anything but pleasant. Of late, though, We've had our hands full just trying to keep the Duchy's few remaining bearers out of the Imperial's clutches. The Cullings. We saw what happened in Old Hill. Aye. The foul work of the Black Shields and their mistress. 
You mean my mother. But it doesn't make sense. Even knowing what I know about her. Her hatred for bearers was no secret, but... She wouldn't have been ignorant of their value to the realm. No offense, my lord. But in case you haven't noticed, the Lady Annabella couldn't care less about the realm. She barely even cares for her own home. That much has been plain since the slaughter at Eastpool. And, since granting the Holy Emperor a new heir, her obsession with bearers only seems to have grown. As to why, I don't know. Maybe she can't bear the thought of anyone having the power to challenge her beloved son. Her son. So wait! The Black Shields are broken camp. They march in full force for Buick Bridge. Then so do we. Make ready. This is their main host. If we remove the head, perhaps... Perhaps we can prevent what happened at the docks from happening somewhere else. If I do nothing, then the blood of their next victims will be on my hands. Yours and ours. We too have witnessed the crimes these men who dare call themselves shields have committed in my mother's name. It cannot be allowed to continue. We must put a stop to this madness. We must. So let us go with you. For the good of Rosaria. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Very well. If that is your wish, I would be honored to serve at your side. And we at yours. So, Wade, let us do our duty. With pleasure, my lord. I imagine this endeavor will require more than just our weights. Then let's hope Sir Wade has a good quartermaster. We'll show them that the fire in our hearts is You're not so... You're telling me that's the Archduke's son.